What's up everybody, D'Angelo here, and this video is going to be on what I spent $84,000 on last year, and I'm going to be like comparing my old life to, you know, how it is now, and, you know, basically just giving you guys some tips and stuff like that or whatever, but um, as you guys can see, I used to work for $374 a week, literally less than $400 a week, and that's busting my ass 40 hours a week. This is when I was on the right path right also be sure to like subscribe and share the video with a friend so that way they can improve their life as well but yeah so this is when i was on you know the the, the right path you know and i had a real job and all that stuff that normal people say or whatever um and like it was not the best life ever i mean obviously i was happy and stuff like that but i mean like financially the wise it was not good. Like, I mean, I had a shitty car that kept breaking down every other day. Um, I had, you know, rent by myself that I had to pay. I had college tuition that I had to pay by myself. I had, you know, college books I had to pay by myself. You know, I had a shitty job that could barely pay for my damn car and I had to just make it work, um, you know. And, like, there's times I've gotten fired. And, true, I've only was in a job marketplace for, like, a year and a half. But, I mean, I had a few jobs during that time or whatnot. Um, I was in sales and stuff like that. You know, that's actually where I got the business mindset at. But yeah, guys, this right here was what I used to make on average, like, you know, a week. And that's not good. That's literally like what? 1600 bucks for the whole month. You know, like that's crazy. Not good at all. And over here, this is money. that I don't even know where it damn where it went. This is money I spent. I spent five times almost five times more money over here just just spending money versus over here where i would have made 15 grand for the entire year and i'm not bragging or anything along those lines like i'm just showing you guys the difference in lifestyle right like this is night and day versus you know over here like over here i was struggling i was wondering how i was going to pay for this how i was going to pay for that i you know would fell two months behind on the rent the whole nine yards over here, I ain't worried about nothing. I'm not working 40 hours a week. You know, I'm not, you know, pinching pennies. I'm I'm not like, you know, doing any of that. I don't even have to go to work. I don't have rent. I don't have car payments. Like any of that. Well, I guess back here I didn't have car payments either. But you guys know what I'm saying. Like, I don't have to worry about too much of anything. Like financially wise, I'm all right. I can just chill around. Like if I really want to just sit and do nothing for the next however many years, I can literally just do that and just sit and the money will just right just come in by itself i don't have to do anything that's the power of making money work for you instead of you working for money you know but i just wanted to show you guys that you know the whole little check here thing because again a lot of people really believe that i just like magically made all this happen overnight and there was like some instant like process like that's not how this stuff works if you see anything online where it's saying oh you're gonna make a million dollars in 30 days you're gonna make twenty thousand dollars in 15 days you're gonna you know follow this three-step program and make this amount of money like odds are that shit's not real all right you gotta look at it just like you would a job if you go into mcdonald's right now and say hey i want to be a manager and they're gonna like okay what's your qualifications well you don't have any what's that mean you're not gonna get that so if you're if you want to come online and you want to make $100,000 a year, what are your qualifications? If you don't have any, you're not going to make any money. It's just that simple. Like, literally, it is just that simple. It's the same exact thing, you know? But, yeah, let's get into this, um, whatchamacallit over here, right? So, um, again, keep in mind, this is literally just one account. No, I did not only spend 1800 bucks for the entire year in groceries. That's just how much I spent on this, uh, on this account here, right? But... I took out about $28,000 last year. I don't know what the hell I did with that, to be honest, which you probably just just taking out random money, doing random shit with it, to be for real. Uh, online services, that's mainly going to be like Facebook ads and, you know, stuff like that, you know, like just regular online stuff like that. And then um, my other expenses, obviously, I can't tell you what that is. It's just like other uh, general I'm guessing that's just like regular gas and like all type of stuff like that home improvement mm, i don't really know that's probably when i shopped at like home depot or something like that you know uh utilities obviously that's like electricity stuff like that uh groceries on this account was 1800 restaurants on this account was 1800 uh business miscellaneous stuff like that uh was 1200 cable 
was eight uh, eight sixteen for the entire, and this is for the entire year, obviously. Insurance seven oh nine, and then the other category was three thousand six hundred, and so the total comes out to eighty four thousand four hundred and two dollars nineteen cent. And you see the difference over here? Like the difference is night and day, like literally night and day, and that's just crazy. All right, and you see, like you see, I see, like this isn't like a screenshot or anything along those lines. You see, like this is all real. All right, and I can keep saying, guys, like it's not going to be easy, but it's going to be worth it. All right, I went from barely making four hundred dollars a week to you know spending six figures a year. Well, in this case, we just say five figures since I'm not showing my other accounts or whatever. You know, spending five figures a year and not even know where the hell I, where, where it's all going. Spend twenty eight thousand dollars a year. That's almost double what I used to make. You don't even know what the fuck I did with it. I don't know. Ain't that some shit? That's crazy. Life can like literally just change, guys. And you can make your life change. You just have to put in the work. And again, this isn't some fairy tale push button software, some nonsense that you're going to see a lot of these people talking about. This isn't you know something where you're going to have to. You know, just put in two hours a day and, and it's magically going to work. Like, you're going to actually have to put in some goddamn work. You have to work as hard as you would at a job, but for yourself. It's just that simple. A lot of people will go out and spend 40, 50, 60 hours a week have with no problem working for someone else, but they can't come home and put in five hours for themselves. How the fuck does that make any sense? You're only, if you're getting like Saturday and Sunday off and, oh, I worked all week, so I can't work for myself. How fucking stupid does that sound? And you guys already know me. Like, I'm going to tell you 100%. Like, this is the cut raw stuff. Like, if you can't dedicate yourself to this, do not even attempt to do it. Quit. I'm going to tell you straight up. Quit. Anybody come to me with any soft-handed stuff, looking to be cuddled, I'm just telling you to quit. This isn't for you. And it, it, that's another thing, Ty, too. This is not for everybody. Like, this whole marketing space here, this isn't for everybody. This takes work, hard work, dedication, investing, right? Like you're going to have to spend thousands of dollars on Facebook ads or if you, if you go on that route or whatever. You're going to have to spend thousands on traffic. It's just that simple, right? You're going to have to pay thousands on courses and stuff like that, right? And it, it's crazy that people, again, will follow the, the traditional path or whatnot and they'll spend forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000 on college with no hesitation, but they'll think they gotta think about spending a hundred dollars on a course. They gotta think about spending five hundred dollars on a course. They gotta think about spending a thousand dollars on a course, five thousand dollars on a course. So you can learn from someone who doesn't know what the fuck they're talking about, except from reading a book, right? People going to go get business degrees from people who have never ran a business. How fucking stupid is that? That sounds extremely stupid. Like, would you try to go learn how to cook from someone who's never cooked before? All he's done is just read a book, and then they're basically reading a book to you. Like, how does how much sense is that? That doesn't make any sense, right? Experience trumps everything. It's just that simple. But that again, that is pretty much it, guys. Um, like I said, I just wanted to show you guys the difference in the lifestyles and stuff like that. And literally everything that I do is over here in Team D'Angelo to help you guys make money. And obviously it's not free. So if you're looking for free, there's nothing I can do for you. Just keep watching the YouTube channel until you're able to, you know, invest more. All right. That's all I can say. But again, that's pretty much it. Be sure to like, subscribe, and you guys can change your life if you truly want it to change. Once you decide you're worth more than an hourly wage... That's when your life will change.